As construction is ramping up in the Central Valley and as we're getting into the summer, we're also taking big strides in Northern California and in our region. The next big milestone for us uh, in the region is to identify the preferred alternatives for our two project sections, San Francisco to San Jose and San Jose to Merced. In July and August, we'll be held, holding a series of public meetings in, uh, along our corridor so that we get feedback from the public. And this will be the first time where the staff will have an opportunity to say, you know, we've been conducting a lot of uh, of technical studies and this is what we're finding. This will give the public and, 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 our, and, and the rest of uh, our stakeholders uh, a better understanding of the routes that we're going to take in Northern California. The feedback that we get on that staff recommended preferred alternative will be incorporated into a board memo and into the staff report that will be presented to the authority board in September. We'll be uh, sharing information with the board on the feedback that we got during those public um, meetings, open houses, and workshops with our community and technical working groups. It's to make sure that when our board is making a, a decision about this, that they're making an informed decision that has the weight of both the staff work as well as the incredible knowledge that exists in the communities along the routes. By asking our board to identify a preferred alternative, we'll be able to introduce that as part of the draft environmental impact report. That will occur in December for the San Jose to Merced section and in March of the following year, in 2020, for the San Francisco to San Jose project. From there, we will have a public hearing, um, as well as a 45-day comment period, where we will be really looking to solicit uh, even more detailed feedback from communities. When it's completed, it will go before the um, authority board for a final action on the preferred project. There will be several opportunities for feedback to let the authority hear your thoughts on the staff recommendation um, over the next couple of months. Additionally, we'll be having our open house meetings in August. Look out on Facebook and Instagram and Twitter for the dates and times and locations of those meetings.